Identity theft happens every single day, and for the victims, the fallout can be a major ordeal and in some cases even a nightmare. That's the case for one local woman. She nearly lost her home because of identity theft, and that is when she decided to get Marty. It's Groundhog Day at Joanne Klotzbaugh's home. Yeah, there's a lot on here. Every day the same thing, trying to figure out who stole her identity and used it to take out loans in her name. Capital One, Citibank, First Citizens Bank. Every entry on this multi-sheet list is an identity theft thief somewhere in the world trying to rip Joanne off. So this is somebody trying to rip you off? Yeah. Record of it? Yes. Page after page? Yep. How many pages do you have? I probably have about six pages here front and back. Joanne's email to me laid it out. I am not aware of how my identity was stolen. All my personal information is being distributed among many, many different scam artists. I worked all my life to have my house and my perfect credit score, only to find I may have neither in the end. Yeah, I started shaking when I opened them out because I saw pictures of my house. I'm like, what is this? There was an appraisal in my house, pictures of the front of the house. She almost lost her house. Identity thieves used her info to get a driver's license, to walk into a Maryland bank to get a home equity loan. I kept calling and calling, telling them it's fraud and telling them that it's not me. I'm a victim of identity theft. But they still didn't want to let it go. They still wanted to give them the money. And that was what was shocking to me. These numbers are shocking. $16 billion stolen from 12.7 million identity fraud victims with a new identity theft fraud victim every two seconds. It is a gigantic problem. Enter identity theft problem solver, attorney James Peets. He is one of the best there is. He agreed to take on Joanne's case for us, admitting it's a battle. It's something that a, a consumer has to really jump on early and then watch it closely. Without a lawyer, here's what you need to do. Put a fraud alert on your credit files at all credit bureaus. Next, get an identity theft report from the FTC, Federal Trade Commission. It's all online. Then get a police report at your local police department. You will have to send those documents to all creditors. And if you don't... There's going to be information on your credit reports. Uh, that you owe this money, that you're delinquent here, uh, that there's a lien on your house, uh, that your bank account's being garnished. And so you'll need to go back and unravel all that. For Joanne, the unraveling has begun. For the first time in more than six months, she sees progress, but not enough. It's just continuous. I don't know when it will end or if it will end. It's unbelievable, really. Her attorney believes she was caught up in the Equifax security breach. That impacted, now wrap your arms around this number, more than 143 million Americans. Her attorney, along with others, talking about significant litigation as a result of the damage done by that Equifax security breach. It's a mess. Yeah, it is a mess. 143 million people, the, uh, the odds are not going to say necessarily good, but good that you might be involved in that. So how can you find out if you are involved in that data breach? Have, have, you, have you checked your name? I have. On yeah. yeah, it's amazing, actually. It's easy, folks. So you go to this site, Equifax Security 2017.com. You click on potential right. impact. Then they ask you to put in your name and the last six digits of your social security number. It'll tell you if you're impacted. And I, I think you should do it right now and freeze your accounts, yeah. if possible. I was, and I froze the account. Did you? Yeah. And, and it was effective? Yeah, yeah it said mine was, was affected. Excellent. Yeah. 143 million. Right. It's crazy. A lot of people. All right, Marty, All right. thanks so much. And if you have a problem and you want to get Marty, you can send an email to get Marty at kdka.com or give us a call, 412-575-2244. And visit kdka.com slash getmarty to see how he is making a difference one story at a time.